straight up. Oh. Imagine you're in paradise. Beautiful, sunny Florida weather. A nice heated pool right here overlooking an NFL stadium full of 70,000 screaming fans. You look down and your team scores the touchdown and the whole place goes nuts. You can only find that in Jacksonville, Florida, baby. Duval! With the home of the Jaguars. If you vibe, don't hit ya. People who ride with ya. Get it live. Who can paint that picture? Ain't no way we losing inches. Climb them fences. Get bruised up, got stitches. Yo, setting off the tour, this is where all the players, coaches, and everyone that has to do anything with the Jaguars facility enters the building. We have our amazing tour guide, Mr. Lori. Tell them who you are, ma'am. I'm Lori Windish. I'm director of construction for the Jacksonville Jaguars. She helped build this entire facility, like top to bottom. She knows the ins and outs, every single square inch of this place, huh? And this is my favorite space. Yeah. This is the gallery. In here we have 100 inch portrait monitors. They are larger than life. These are changed every game. So the team photographers change them on Sunday nights. It's, oh my goodness. It's like a big movie theater, bro. Of course, this is where they have the team in. Coach is probably right here addressing the guys. Let them know we're gonna handle business. So part of what makes this space unique is it was specifically designed that all the players could enter from the bottom, mm -hmm. from the locker room, and all of our offices are upstairs. So from the back, all of the coaches can come down. Come in it's from like lower. That's right, everybody swap. kind of comes in together. Oh, they got the nice Jag logo on them. I feel like I'd fall asleep in the meetings. This is terrible to You're say. You're not but. gonna fall asleep. All this was designed by Rosetti, our architects. It's bamboo accents along the walls. This is the fanciest facility I've ever heard of. Bro. Welcome to Jacksonville. Wow. Do you know where the players sit or not really? There's not a signed seating. T-Law, if you're not sitting here, bro, we're gonna have problems. You know? team dining. So this is where we feed our players and staff every day. They got the chef kitchen in the middle, buffet style meals. They got the great tables here for all the players. Ah, oh, damn, that's crazy. They got cereal over here. They got fruit. We have a full breakfast every morning for players. One very special piece about our team dining room is our pizza oven. Oh, I see it in the corner. Welcome to the Jack's Pizzeria. How can I serve you? Pepperoni. We're working very hard for the Jack's. Cooking pizza every day. I work too hard for this. If you like and subscribe, you can have this pizza. Go Jags. They even have a kombucha machine. I've never even had a kombucha before. Gee, what is this? Lavender, lemonade, or blueberry? I'm gonna try the lemonade. This is a baby sip, because I'm not a huge kombucha guy. <laughs> Gotta smell it first. Oh, it's actually pretty good. It's not sweet at all, though. I thought kombucha was sweet, no? Yeah. Which one's this, blueberry? Oh, damn. Taste test. But the blueberry is actually really good. First question. Why are you at the podium? You here to ask me questions. Who are you? I'm destroying. Uh, Donald Delahaye. Who cares about you? Next question. What do you do? You, you play football? I could play receiver. I could do kicker. Um, I do YouTube. Um, a lot of people watch my videos and stuff. Why are you making that face? <laughs> what? What is so f I ain't say no joke up here. Are you, are you done? Next question. You play receiver? How do you keep popping up? In Where? Now that the pro hater has left the building, I don't know, that guy followed me from the Vikings facility. I don't even know how he got in. But what is this room? This is our media workroom. This is where we do press conferences with our coach. And this is also where the media can come work during the day, during practice. Do you ever have any haters in here asking the coach crazy questions? Uh, occasionally. We if have you ever answers. see that guy, ban him from the building. Put his picture up outside the door and don't let him in. But this is dope though. I like the backdrop, the Everbank, the Jags logo. This is awesome. Where to next? The podcast room. This is our podcast room. This is where we do a variety of shows wow. for the team. There's a bunch of cameras around. Yes, we have cameras around that will shoot every position from the table of all the our Doug team members. The Peterson show. Now it's the Destroying show. This is dope, man. Get out. I love when the good news coming in on a day to day. Already know what's happening. Now I gotta shake the A. Oh, the weight room. My favorite part. This is a 9,500 square foot weight room. We have 14 Sorenex weight racks. We also have a 13 square foot cardio deck. First, let me see the weights first. Cause you know, some weights don't be feeling as heavy as others, but these are NFL weights, so they definitely will feel a little heavy. Usually we fake this. You know, I put the little skits in where there's no weights, but this is a real weight, 225. <sighs> Easy work. And the indoor is right there too. So it was a big deal to connect our indoor to yeah. the weight room so we can open it up and just have continuity. The entire wall graphic was designed by our head coach. To him. Always earned, never given. That's correct. Do you ever work out in here or what? Today I'm gonna work out in here. For real? What you trying to do? We can do a couple pull-ups. You can do pull-ups? We're gonna try. Let's go, Lori! Let's go! Let's go! Ooh, okay. How many you want for me? Five. That's it? Uh, uh, mm, mm. Ah! Uh.
Always earned, never given. Now that we got that workout in, I gotta put some in my belly. I heard you guys got a state of art nutrition center right here. We do, we have a Gatorade fuel bar. So our nutritionist team puts out a variety of snacks. All Who's healthy. back there doing pull-ups, so you gotta get yes. your protein. Yes, everything's healthy. There's drinks for hydration. Yeah. It's like a bar where they cook up the drinks and stuff too? Yes, they will be making smoothies, protein shakes. Uh, and the bars, nutritionist bars. is always here to guide you. They were always here to tell you like, should you be having a couple of pistachios? Are you supposed to be having a stinger at this time? Yeah, I if I grab some protein, I feel like? them, them reps a little bit. I gotta hit the fridge. Give me a little muscle milk real quick. Uh, should I go chocolate or vanilla? Or strawberry though? Leave it in the comments. But I think I'm gonna grab chocolate. Oh my goodness. Welcome to our indoor practice field. It has got Hellas artificial turf down. State of the art turf. That is wow. organic coconut and cork fiber. Oh, that's cool. That just sounds fancy. And it is watered. So it's we watered? actually have irrigation you in the here. Turf? This is a new kind of turf. It is the best. Um, a lot of teams are using it. It's instead of rubber pellet infill. That's crazy. I've never heard of watering turf. Watering artificial grass, not so that it grows. I guess so it stays hydrated and soft? Correct. Of course, they got all the drill machines on the side, the nets where the quarterbacks could throw. This is 120 yards of football field. Don't correct me because the end zone's 10, the field's 100, and the other end zone's 10. The state of art goal posts which are my yeah favorites. we like our hanging goal posts for safety reasons yeah. and for aesthetics so guys don't run into it Correct. you know we had some guys smack into ours that one on one it's not a good thing those are back to college in orlando i just come to indoor at like midnight and just come in here focus have some peace put some headphones in and just headphones we in turn it up loud oh, in i got here. the speakers in here too okay, okay. i'm in your town i'm coming your way just wait up me and my team ain't taking no l's i told them you don't want to Hey y'all boys, now we in the equipment room. This is where the magic goes down. We got my man George, the head of the equipment staff here. So give us a tour of his kingdom, man. So this is where the magic happens. There's so much. Saying. You walk in and you're greeted by all these college yeah. helmets. The college helmets, the top two rows are the top 25. Okay. And so it's bragging yeah, rights. So you guys update it all we the time. We do. Every, oh. Yep, yeah, my guys, we, we update it every week. So guys, it's kind of bragging rights. They come in, they're like, oh man, that's it's a lot, a lot of fun. Of work, it's a lot man. of fun. Our old space, we had about, about 1,500, 2,000 square feet. We have about 4,500 square feet in this one, which is awesome, but we want them to still be efficient. Like this, this is a space saver table. So this moves this out and we have storage in. We I've never it. seen these. I've seen yeah. the big yep. shelves, but I've never seen the space so, you know, saver when table. We were, when we were planning it out. We got, you know, friends at Notre Dame, different colleges. Mm -hmm. but, hey man, what, what do you need to get that's cool? They showed me this, I was like, we need that. Yeah. How long have you been here, man? So this is my 20th season. 20th season, he yeah, an yeah, NFL man, vet, was... man. Show me some of the drip, yeah. man. This is what we're wearing this week. Oh. This is the one that everybody wants to see. This one right here. Oh, this the T-Law yeah. jersey? That's the one. This is the magical jersey right here, man. Starting quarterback, Trev, damn, that's crazy. You're really about to wear this on Sunday, man. <laughs> do you guys have alternate jerseys, or how does that work? Uh, we do not. We Our alternate jerseys are black, and we'll wear that next week when we play the Titans. What we're wearing are set each July. Yeah, oh, tread. so you figure out the whole season? The whole season. We know oh, what wow. jersey we're wearing every single game. The pants and the socks we can change mm. up until game day. I want to see what's behind the walls, yeah. man. Yeah. Oh, man. So the gloves are on the front one, but this will be the shoes. Any ten and a halves in here, my man? I don't know. We might be able to find some. These are Calvin's, you said? Yeah, there's some old ones. Ooh, look at the bottom, bro. This is insane. I don't even know what to call this. Like, it ain't carbon fiber. What do you call this material down here? That's just a, uh, an application they put on. Calvin material, yeah. we'll call yeah. it that. Calvin. <laughs> oh, he wore a 10 and a half. Yeah, oh, that's convenient. <laughs> no, this is dope. I've never seen a helmet with it's, this It's uh, 3D printed. Yeah, they oh, 3D what? print it, yeah. Bruh, they do it differently in the NFL. Oh, I see. The old white gloves, y'all boys. I gotta get some grip boots in here, man. Grip boots. I might call my people and get you yeah, all your helmet. All right. That's grip in the game, but this is second school. Oh, I feel like a kid in a candy store right now. Not only to myself, but like all the kids at home watching, all the recruits. This stuff is the most inspiring. You know, they yeah. go on all these visits. They want the gloves. They want the cleats. They want the this, the that. This is where you aim to be at the top of the top, the lead. You work hard enough, you can make it. Speaking of it, though, man, yeah. when can I get some of this gear? Well, I might have some set up for you if you wanna. Oh, for real? Come on out here. Why are we going that way? He loves locker. Oh, I mean, no, no way. Damn, what? No way. Destroying at the top, number 11, next to T Law's locker. And a jersey, fam? Damn, this is beautiful. Been a little too nice to y'all. Now I got a up price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. Bro. 86 all the hay. I won't get a ball today. Got lost in the ball today. I'm flipping the balls. I'm flipping the flipping the flipping the ball. Oh, for the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, lab on me going all the way. For the record, ain't trying to link no time to waste. 
Damn. Yeah, how's the uniform fit? Ah, oh, this thing is amazing. I feel like a kid in a candy store. The locker room is great. Nice and comfortable, nice plush seats. I'm gonna check out the rest of the locker room now. I know it's some great players in here. Yeah. I wanna see what they lockers yeah. look like. T-Law right here, this is yeah. crazy. Okay, this is the type of gear. He keeps this place clean. Yeah. I always make sure people's lockers are clean, man. It tells me a lot about them. Is there any specific way y'all organize it by players this or? This side offense, that side's defense. Mm -hmm. We got the O-line kind of this end, running backs. Quarterbacks on the wall. Okay. We got the receivers, tight ends. Hey man, you forgetting one key position. We're special teams, the kickers, the uh, Hunters, we put those over guys the ones the that matter. Let me go see their lockers, man, because <laughs> my books, them the most important guys on the team. Brandon McManus. Logan Cook. Hunter Ross. I'm guessing he's the long snap. Yes. You want to go see the golf simulator? Yeah, we got a the golf, sim golf simulator, a barber. Come on, bro. All right, let's go. Welcome to Jagged Edge, my brothers, where you get all your hairstyle needs taken care of. Y'all usually bring barbers in or what? Yep, we have three guys every Friday. We'll get my edge up, bro. I got a two in with him next week, man. My edge up a little messed up right now. I got helmet hair, but I know if you a Jags barber, you kind of NFL boys, you gotta be certified, fam. Up next to golf, Tiger Hoods. I do top golf. I don't know about this golf simulation. It's the first time I've done it. Ah. I'd spend all my time back here. You know they say kicking is a lot like golf. It takes a lot of the same mechanics, the swinging, the head down, just staying focused. That boy Evan Ingram got his own bag. That's two bags. How Evan Ingram got two bags? Now adjacent to the golf simulator, we got the gaming lounge. You guys can play Xbox, PlayStation. We got like four 90 inch TVs. We got the ping pong back there. This is a great place for the guys to come together and fellowship and relax. <laughs> I don't want to get out this uniform, but unfortunately we have to. We got to see the rest of the facilities. We got the stadium coming up next, fam. The stadium. But first, we got to get out of this. Alright y'all, so we've seen all the practice facilities, we've seen where the Jags work out and where they get that work in. Come on now. Now we in front of Everbank Stadium. What are we on right now? What is this? Touchdown Jaguar right here. It's a famous, famous statue right here. Google it if you know. I heard that you guys got some dope things in the stadium. How many people holes in it? At least 70,000 plus, man. So if anybody's saying anything, the Jaguars ain't got fans, we in there. And I heard y'all got a pool. Come on, we got a pool. Let's go, man. Let's do it. Ooh. All right, so we walk through the marketing offices, we enter the stadium. We're transitioning, what they the call it. The vibe just instantly changed, bro. Where yeah, are we right this now? This the rubber hallway. Yeah, this is where the business happened. We're going right into the game day locker room. Right over here, we got the winning division wall. So they're keeping track of every divisional matchup because you can't win the chip without the division. Nah, so. we need to change Yeah, this, we got to fix that. We got to fix Why that. Why is the L on there? They got a hold of us the first matchup, but we'll be seeing around Thanksgiving. What does this mean to y'all right here, though? Yeah, work man, to win. Work to win, man. So, like, Coach Peterson, man, he, he has all these phrases all around the building of how, like, he wants the team. Messaging okay. to, to speak, you know what I'm saying? That's how it goes. Work the win. Work the win, man. You ain't gonna win unless you work. My boy. Oh, yeah. You gotta tap the jag when they walk in. Oh, this is tough. Oh, boy, this is. Wow. I just love the colors, bro. Yeah. This is just the game day locker room right here. So, like, they got another locker room in the MEC across. I wanna see Trevor Lawrence locker, bro. Let's make where, he at? where he at? Where he at? Where he at? This is where Coach be giving the speeches in the middle? Right in the middle. This is where the post game victory speech goes, man. All right, man, we gotta work the win. How is Coach? Is he, like, outspoken? Is he loud? Is man, he more chill? Coach P is too cool. Cool, man. He cool oh, as a fan. He, 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 gets, he gets live. Okay. He cool as a okay. fan. He okay. a guy you want to play for. You peek at T. Law, you look to his right. You got a soldier right next to him. Ooh, hold on, bro. Ooh. <laughs> you see it? I love y'all's colors, bro. This is where the legend Trevor Lawrence, Mr. Sunshine, Mr. Clemson be balling from, man. Look at the detail. The neon blue lights. You got your own little lock box. Mine's locked right now. Y'all can't see what's inside of here. They got rolly chairs, fam. Hop on one, bro. You got to slide with me. <laughs> Hey, where the trade room at? Fail. Hey, that's smooth, bro. Nah, I gotta run that back, bro. I pushed a little too hard. All right, bro, I'm gonna put the rolly chairs down. I wanna talk about this, bro. This is amazing. It just kind of ties the whole locker room together. What y'all call this? Is this like the shield, the crest? It's just the shield, you yeah. know what I'm saying? This is where all of the big, like you say, the big post-game speech yeah. is going down. We standing right here in the okay. middle. Trevor right yep. here, breaking the team down, Doug, encouraging everybody. But over there, I see something interesting. Right. Y'all got some hot tubs in there? Bro, hot tubs and cold tubs in the player locker room slash bathroom. Oh, it's nice and warm. Too. Coming right, coming right out of practice. So uh -huh. just come jump in. Oh, they both warm. Wait, this one's warmer than that one. The sauna with the teal lights, bro. I love the marketing. This is smooth, bro. I feel like I'm in a club. Oh, 
Ooh. All right, so we walk out the locker room. We're met with another beautiful hallway. Hold on. Look at this wall right here. Everything matters. Number one, eliminate distractions, fam. Come on, man. Number two, create that energy, fam. Come on, man. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Three, fear nothing. Yeah. <clears throat> Number four, most important, attack everything. Everything moving. Small fact that y'all probably don't know, but this right here, this logo, was my high school logo as well. I don't know how they didn't get copyrighted, but they changed all the teal to red, and we were the Port St. Lucie Jaguars. And y'all know our phrase. It was always the Jaguars. It was Jazz. always the Jaguars, fam. You feel me? <laughs> And over here, just some mottos and some words that, you know, really power the team. Trust, loyalty, respect, leadership, unity, accountability, focus. Live by them words, you're gonna live a great life, fam. So this is on the way to the uh, flex field, you Yeah, said? we're on the way to the flex, right? Oh, cool. We having some one-on-ones out there, so make sure y'all check in the next video. Got a couple Jag legends right here, man. Hall of Famer, Tony Buscelli. Freddie T, man. Fred Taylor, my favorite on here, man. Not only did I see him on the podcast and stuff, but he always been an OG. He's always showing he real love, for man. Sure. He's a real one, bro. Legend around here. Man. He's a real one. Every single day I feel the pleasure Double up the work, let's make it extra Working so my mother get a rest, yo Oh yeah, Jacksonville, let me hear y'all turn out real quick! Yo! Oh man, it's only one person. Okay, that's fair. Let me come down there real quick. All right, bro, so y'all got this big stage over yeah, here. Y'all got 10,000 seats. What? What is this? Where man, are we? We in the Daily's Place Amphitheater, man. Okay. Dirt done slid through, raw okay. wave. Oh, I guess they ain't hear that the storm is coming. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody here. Uh, we gotta promote better, fam. We gotta promote better. Fam. What's behind these walls over here? That's where the magic going down at this weekend, man. That's where the mm. one's going, man. That's so, the flex field. Got the stadium, you got the amphitheater, flex field. Let's go check it out. Push it to the limit, I can't go no more. Red light, no way I'm coming back home. Long dirt road all on my own. I'ma be the greatest, draw my name in the stone. Draw my name in the stone. Oh, is that not this again, bro. I just got cut from the Vikings cheerleaders, no. bro. So now we're gonna try for the Jags, you feel me? We're gonna try this again, boys. We got cut by the Vikings. I wasn't good enough. So now we're over here in Jacksonville trying to become a Jags cheerleader member. I could do flips, I could do all that stuff. You know, I, I got a little rhythm to me. You might show you a kick line and yeah. then maybe you can try it with and us. Then you can... Oh, hell no. Nah. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, I got... I gotta do that. I was following with this, but then... Uh, <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I got. Do we have to flare them around and stuff? Smile the whole time too. Oh, I fucked up! I fucked up! I fucked up! I fucked up! I messed up! I got it. Don't cut me, please. Chill out, y'all boys. Ah, yeah, yeah. What's next? What's next? Oh, fan. Uh, Nah, this is where they got me. They made it seem easy. They say just do this and put your leg up. And they're doing all type of turns. I don't know. I'll take it. I want to see if you guys are great at the cheerleading, but how are you guys with football though? Oh, great. I got you. Y'all know it ain't a destroying video. We're going to put these ladies through some football drills. Who's up first? Receiver? I need a receiver and I need a DB. Let's see if she's going to be our, our all-time quarterback. Okay. Oh, she got an arm. That might be our quarterback then. Let's see it. Okay, quick slay. Ah! Even though I ain't do nothing. <laughs> you got some speed on you. Pick to the crib, to the crib, to the crib! All right, now we in the stadium, man. Pride of Jacksonville. What's the vibes like on game day? Cause it's I crazy. know it's loud. It gets crazy in here, dog. Our home atmosphere is wild, man. A lot of people don't know about it. Cause you know, Jacksonville, yeah. small town, small market. Well, I love y'all Jaguars, boy. They go down Jack. in the bank. That's so smooth, yeah, bro. bro. Look at the TV, the screen, bro. I think that's one of the biggest screens I've ever seen. Oh, easily. Come on now, we got two, two of them. <laughs> bro, I've been looking at me the whole time. <laughs> that's crazy, bro. <laughs> What's the meaning behind this? This man? right here is the first uh, Duval station. Every okay. week we have a new fan player okay. come up here and get a city chant. This is okay. the, the city chant right here. You in Duval okay. County, this the battle cry. You go here every Sunday. That's what we ride with, man. If you want to spend a little bit of money and enjoy some premium seats at the Jags game, you can join the Gallagher Club. Oh, owner suite? God. This is the owner suite, the people that own the team, billionaires. We're bees, fam. Oh, hold on, hold on. Coach coming for the ones. I want you to feel oh. welcome in here, man. Oh my goodness, the view, bro. He's splitting the 50. My right arm is on the 51. My left arm is on the 49. Oh, these feel like owner seats. I already know they be having a private chef back there cooking up. Let's go to the kitchen real quick. Anything you could want and need, they in here cooking hibachi, boy. Cook it up. Right, that's how you know you in the owner suite when the glasses look like this. 
This ain't no straight glass. This ain't no, this is state of the art. Yeah. You know, once the chef done cooking up over there, we got the buffet style platter. Unlimited eats, my boy. Shad Khan, oh, that's the owner. Presenting the Shad Khan Jaguars versus the Bills. Playoff win. Hope Shad invite me to watch the game up here. Right now we in the premium seating. As soon as you pop outside of the owner suite, yeah. you got big island bars down Versus, here. As well. I feel like you can see everything from here. Absolutely. Them windows, you can see the practice field, you can see the fair, the whole city. The Jaguar downstairs. Yeah. Down here we got the big banquet hall. You Jeez. can still enjoy the scenery and still enjoy the game at the same time. They be having a lot of music back there? Absolutely. Y'all do it right in Duval, man. Let's right. do it right in Duval. Can't make a promise, but I do my best. 25 sitting on 25 racks. Just got started, no, we ain't done yet. But a new crib, that's a goddamn flex. Bro, there's a lot of amazing places to watch the game from. They got the owner suite, they got the club suites. Boy, they even have a whole entire pool, bro. It's insane. They got one on the other side, they go. Oh, oh bro. <laughs> Tell me what they already think about it now. Used to hate it, but I guarantee they're proud. Had to do it just to show them that I could, yeah. All right, y'all, we seen it all. My dog Lot took us through it. Y'all seen what these NFL players go through. Y'all seen the practice facilities. You seen the stadium. It's a vibe out here in Duval, Ooh, man. Yeah, man. So I'm still not over this, bro. It's crazy. Make sure y'all work hard, bro. You guys work hard, chase your dreams, believe in yourself, and always work hard on the next man. You too could live this life. That you too could be in here. That you too could be in the practice facilities, man. Love, Appreciate man. you, Lot. Much love. love. Duval, yeah. So nice to y'all. I got a up price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. Frozen. A6 all the hate. I won't get involved today. Got lost in the